Hello everybody and welcome to a new, to the first ever episode of our Minecraft Let's Play. We are going to be playing on Minecraft 1.19.2, mostly vanilla, we do have some data packs installed and, um, so I'm going to briefly list those real quick so you all know what we're going to be dealing with. We have Terralith, um, which is going to be responsible for all the cool terrain generation and stuff we're going to find. I have a mod that gives us new terrain for the nether and the end. So we'll find some interesting stuffs in there. I've got a mod... not mods. I said mods. I meant to say data packs. There's a data pack that changes... That adds some new achie new advancements. If we want to take a look, you'll see we only have three tabs, but I'll figure out why that one's been done in a minute. Um, but we have all kinds of new advancements we'll be able to encounter. Um, and then as for resource packs, I'll take you on a brief little tour of my resource packs. Um, none of these we're using. But we have Minecraft Reimagined Fresh Animations, the Reimagined Fresh Animations Compatibility Resource Pack, one that makes item frames invisible, and one that makes buckets and fish 3D. And another thing this one does is if you have like a fish or an axolotl in a bucket, it'll actually show what kind of fish or what color axolotl you have in the bucket. Which I think is going to be really helpful when we start building aquariums, because yes, I do plan on building aquariums. However, I believe the first thing that we need to do, the first order of business, if you will... Oh, and look at that. The leaves are turning brown because they're going to decay. But I believe our first order of business is going to be obtaining some wood. So let's go ahead and mine some wood. And just because I'm curious, what biome is this? It is the... Um, block. It is the Arid Highlands. Alright, and what do we have here? A moss block. I will take one, but not that one. I want this one. Our moss block. From this moss block, we shall grow an entire army of mosses. We shall make very lush caverns. I think that's packed mud. Um, yeah, it's packed mud. I don't know how I knew that. I've never even used packed mud before. But I guess it just looked like mud, but hard. So, I guess it was packed mud. I'm gonna go ahead and break these. And let's get started by crafting our first tool set. Um, I do not want to live in this biome, though. I do want to find a different biome to live in. So, let's place that down. We're going to need a pickaxe, axe, and a sword just for now. I don't want to make anything else until we get stone tools. Because shovels are just so fragile, and I can just easily grab dirt with my bare hands. I don't need a shovel for dirt. Whoa. I heard a zombie. Oh, probably from down there. You'll see what the zombies look like with fresh animations. It's so cool. Let me just take a minute. Let's just take a minute to grab some stone. I hear it. I hear it below me, and that is very creepy. Um, ow. I did not mean to do that. This is a interesting cave. I just want the coal. That is all I want. Some torches to light the night, please.
See, look at this motherfucker. All right, there we go. Zombie is taken care of. Getting some yummy, yummy, yummy experience. Nom, 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 nom. Um, is this coal vein ever gonna end? Like, as much as I admit we need coal, it is very slow mining it with the stone pickaxe, but I refuse to stop until I get all of it. Oh my god. Okay, look. Really? This is just too much. Oh, thank God. Almost 30 pieces of coal. This is all clay. Good to know there are places with a high amount of clay. And I wish to find... We kind of want to look for a village, see if we can find one of those. Which would mean we need to head to the... Acacia... to the savanna. Oh, speak of the devil. Uh, this house looks a little roofless. Although it has a bed. Villagers, I have arrived. That is such a sick animation. Cartographer, huh? Sheep! Beep, beep, bum a sheep. I said beep, beep, bum a sheep. Okay, what do you have t to offer? You. I can craft those myself. I don't need your shitty stone tools. <gasps> Emerald. Stone and smooth stone. And you know what? I'm going to steal some wheat. I'm going to steal some wheat. Are any of you a farmer? 20 wheat for an emerald. Um... Let me check all your other houses for interesting stuff. A bed... You know, I could probably sleep here and reset- and set my spawn for the night. I don't know if I want to live here yet, though. Um, it is a nice village, but it's just missing a certain something. I will stock up on emeralds, though. Food and emeralds. Yeah, yeah, it broke, I know. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Gimme, gimme, gimme something. Okay, I think this is the last bunch of hay bales.
Cartographer, armorer, you, farmerer. How much? All right, uh, that is enough for now. And you need a house with the bed, with the bed, 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 bed. Okay. Let's just sleep. Uh, because I don't want to deal with monsters at night. And then I want to check out what's in this house. Nothing of interest. Alright, stone pick, stone axe, uh, stone shovel, yeah, we'll go ahead and get the shovel, and then I need a new sword. And then, from there, bread, food, sustenance. There is no bed in here. I'm gonna steal one of your beds. Um, simply because I would like to be able to keep it daytime while I wander around and search for a dwelling place. A good biome I could lay my head in and rest. Oh, I love how crop fields look. They look so good, are you kidding me? Mm, oak wood. Yes. I will take the oak wood as well. Recipe books don't matter so much. Ooh, wheat. Apples. Some bread, and then we will be on our way. Um, but where to? Where to? I say we keep going this away. I love the resources this biome has, however, the, the, the grass type just doesn't do it for me. I don't- I like lush looking grass. Lush greenery, please. That's rooted dirt. Nice. Said beep beep, I'm a sheep, I said beep beep, I'm a sheep. Beep beep, I'm a sheep, I said beep beep, I'm a sheep. Um, God, this biome just stretches on for ages. Almost makes me want to cross the ocean, but I'm not sure. But at this point, pretty sure if I cross the ocean, I'm still going to find this place. Well, hey, look, a proper green biome. Even if it is just the river's edge. Greenery. Oh, that's a big tree for this biome. What have we got over here? Ugh. 
Ooh, this biome looks even more dead. That is not grass, that is probably coarse dirt. Greenery. Greenery. Ugh, it's in the form of a river again. Oh, what is what is this place? It is a shrubland. Ew, icky. I don't like this biome. It's icky. It's icky and dry and not vibrant at all. Can we get, can we get a jungle or something? Can I find one of those, please? A, a, a jungle or a, or a swamp or a swamp or whatever kind of biome this is what is this biome it's a river it's the driest river I've ever seen Squid. Okay, how far does the dryness of the river stretch on? Um... Pretty decently far, actually. Only starts turning into a proper river again right here. Alright, so we're gonna follow the river, actually, and see if that will lead us to our new home. Um, I am probably gonna speed up or cut out most of the, um, trip, most of this trip, unless something interesting happens. So, I will see you all... Then, I will see you all either once something interesting happens, or when we get to a new base location. All right, everybody, and we are back just a moment for what appears to be another village. Hello, I'm here to steal your things. You have carpets. Nice. I'm going to make sure we put carpets in our house whenever we actually start building. I did not mean to set my spawn there. But, you know, it is what it is. Do y'all not have chests? Ooh. This is a blue bed, though. I want this one. Oh, sorry. It's Cyan.
Sea pickles? I won't say no. Really? Was this it? Was this the entire village? Oh, no, there's one more structure. Does this one have a chest? That is a weird pattern to put on the ground. No. Okay, so no chests from this village. Um, let's get back on with our expeditioning. Ooh, ooh, and right away we find an interesting biome. Right next to a coral reef, and I guess it is near a village for ease of trading. The lily pads are a weird color. The lily pads in the grass are a weird color. Literally, the only thing that would make this biome perfect is if axolotls were to would spawn here. That is probably the one thing that could convince me to settle here. A desert oasis, huh? <gasps> Lush greenery. Yes, please. Oh, hold on. I do want to take with me. This azalea. Whoopsies. Oh, well. And is there another azalea somewhere that I can grab to use in, like, building and stuff? Or to grow into an azalea tree that I can cut down? Because this one I don't want to cut down. This one is going to be special. This one is the azalea of power and destiny. Okay, so... I guess not. And so, with that, let's move into the jungle. Yeah. Lush greenery, there's a village just down that way. What's not to like? Ah, uh, yes, this is a very mighty jungle. Ooh, it's got chickens! Oh, uh, it's surrounded by icky biomes on all sides, though. Is this really the perfect jungle? Um... No, let's keep adventuring. Oh, and here is a discovery. I... Oh my. Okay, but look at the glow squids, though. They're really pretty. Ah, zombies! Zombie villagers, even! Ooh, this must be a zombie village. Hello? Ah, uh, part of me wants... Part of me thinks it would be really fun.
if what we did was we lived here and we kind of cleaned this village up and brought villagers and life back to it. Wouldn't that be neat? A fun little project. I heard that. I ain't scared of you. Okay, hold on. What trash do I have? I don't really need lily pads. I'm keeping my bed. Of course I am. Ooh, that was close. Okay, the first step is finding a building and claiming it as our home. Oh, hello! Can I keep you trapped in there, please? Like, genuinely, I want you to be one of our villagers. There aren't any holes in the roof, are there? No. Okay, so you're one of us now. Any other zombie villagers I find are also going to be trapped in here. Oh, hello. Here, let me help. There you go, is that better? Alright, so now our spawn point is set at the village. Let's continue with our looting. And then I guess we can start on making one spot habitable. Yeah. So much cactus. I need to teach them about flower variety. Good gracious. Alright, but... Yeah, part of me thinks... No... Yes... No... Should I... I really don't like this grass color, though. It's a desert oasis. Shouldn't be. Shouldn't it be a little more green? Doesn't. Wouldn't that make sense for it to be a little more green and lush and vibrant? Not everything has to be green and lush and vibrant. Alrighty. Let us pick a stra- Hello. Yes, I know you want- Out, but you're not getting that. So chill. I have so much work to do. Mm. 
Okay. So then he Okay. First order of business is I need a new crafting table because I had to use mine to lock up the walls. Okay, now clean up the cobwebs. I want my cyan bed. All right. Um where can I can I plant regular saplings on moss? Because if I can, most of the floor here is going to be pretty mossy. Okay. There we go. The hell? <sighs> Alright, now we begin the very complicated process of... Getting things done. JK, JK, it's not all that complicated. Um... I'm gonna put valuables in here. Um, miscellaneous shit in here. Alright, I will also need acacia wood and sugar cane for paper. What kind of button? Oh, jungle! Okay, so y'all are using jungle. Which means I will need to go back to the jungle to collect some jungle saplings. Okay, okay, that's fine. Not a big deal, not a big deal. Let me... whoops. Let me just plant these first. Put them away in here. I'll take the cut sandstone. There we go. At least one part of my wall is fixed. God, I have so much work to do. It'd probably improve Oh good wheat. Um If I could get a name tag, I would like to give you a name so you don't despawn. That would be great. Unless do can zombie villagers from this from these despawn? Uh, let me Google that real quick. Okay. So I just need to give it something. Can I craft, um... I'm gonna give you a little shovel to hold. And as soon as I get a name tag, you're getting named, too. But for now, this shovel should do the trick.
Okay, but will you pick up my sword? Okay, so apparently that won't work. Um, and zombies only have a chance to spawn with the ability, so we're gonna have to... We're gonna have to hope. Hope and pray. And also, um, go back to that village and hope there's a librarian villager. That is literally our only chance right now. Um, let's grab a wooden sword. I mean, stone sword, stone sword, stone sword. Alright, I will be back, buddy. Don't you worry. My only concern now is making sure I'm going the right way. Um, I think I came from this way. No, because that's a lot of water, so I definitely came from this way. If I hit the jungle, then I'll know I'm going the right way. If I don't, well, I don't hit the jungle and I was going the wrong way. Actually, let me try going diagonal the other way. I just want to... Ow! Ooh, hold on, there might be a name tag in here or something. Let me check. Okay, but that doesn't guarantee I will be able to... Name him because I don't have an anvil. Okay, but at this point I might be able to craft one. Whoopsies! Okay, so, let's go back and get our stuff, because that was all of my emeralds and things, you know, which are pretty dang important for villager trading, if I wanted to trade and get that stuff. Iron, there's my levels, the majority of my other shit, sugar cane, there's that shit. And I still gotta visit the lower levels of the ship. Oh, this is gonna be a nightmare. Okay.
Oh. Uh, this is an interesting sudden lag spike. Um... Paper, an empty map, a buried treasure map. We could go after that. Sandstone. Paper, thorns, unbreaking, suspicious stew, rotten flesh. Oh shit. Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't kill me. Okay, which I do think then that I came from this way. Um, look, I mostly just need to find that jungle again. And then, note to self, this time make a sign showing the direction of the village and the jungle. Um... Let's see here. Alright. Fine, I get it. Cobwebs and whatever. Oh, I think I know which way I entered the village from. It was from here, because I remember looking down at glow squids. That is a drowned. Terrifying. Me no likey. Which means I think I came from over here. Alright, so we are going to... I'm going to speed up time until I find the jungle and or the village. Okay, well I found a village. This isn't the village, but it's a village. I wonder if they know their next door neighbors have been uh, zombified. But on the bright side... You take emeralds for wheat. Home is that way. Home is southwest. Okay. Oh, and look, there's a jungle. Perfect. I'll grab some jungle saplings while I'm here. Yes, I'm stealing their wheat. And... Ooh, since this village is so close, if I get iron, and I need to, I can just transport villagers over here. Over there from here. Population replacement, if required. Do any of these buildings happen to be library buildings? Fletcher. You don't have a job.
Well, we're gonna steal all of these. At the very least, they can be used for food stores. Well, I get a functional farm and all that going. I just heard scribbles. Where's the librarian? Oh, no. Don't tell me you're a cartographer. God. Freaking... What do you do? You're a mason, huh? Alright. Bite, so your trades are mildly interesting. I wonder what other stuff you could sell. However, I need a freaking librarian. Alright, there should... Ah, shit. I'm not good with spiral staircases in Minecraft. I always fall down. Wheat and bread. I'll take that. I don't need the dead bushes or the cactus. If I can trap that iron golem, I can get more iron, which in, oh great, a ladder to nowhere, yay. But anyway, in theory, that would mean that I, bread, 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 bread. I can... Okay, up! Uh... Let me sleep! Well, that was productive. That's only enough to make two iron blocks. I'm gonna need more iron if I want to make a freaking anvil. Up. Creeper, great, just when I need it. You know what? I will. You are not a librarian. You are a cartographer. Well, you know what?
I do want to map out the areas around me. Alright, so let's not only get the sugar as much sugar cane as we can to make paper, but also, uh, should grab the jungle wood while we're here. Yeah, jungle saplings are a need. Look at all these tropical fish. Oh, I can't wait to breathe life into our own village. It's gonna be so much fun. I don't know how this rabbit died. I don't think I want to know. Oh my goodness, these guys are actively having children. This must be a prosperous village. Okay, now I need to find that cartographer. Absolutely not. Cart oh, cartographer! Farmer. Job. Cartog. That. Ooh. Okay, you know what? Let me get just get my jungle wood in peace. And then I'll check on the cartographer, see if the cartographer has anything new and interesting. Some kind of special treasure map that we could explore, perhaps? And then I still will want to check for the buried treasure. Hey. Alright, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Just... I just need a jungle sapling. That's all. I just need one. Preferably more than one. But I'll accept a singular. Uh, I'll go ahead and... Ooh, north... Sorry. Uh, microphone hit my shirt. 
Come on, is there really no... This is bullshit. This is bullshit. Why do jungle saplings drop so few leaves? I mean, sap. Why do jungle trees drop so few saplings? It's ridiculous. You. Eleven emeralds and a compass. You'll get an ocean explorer map, presumably to show where an ocean temple is. Okay, so that's not too bad of a map. What are you doing all the way out here, nitwit? You are not opposed to be out here. Okay, if I can't get jungle saplings, at least let me get all of the jungle wood this year. Come on, three. Ah, there's one. Okay, so I got one sapling. Two saplings! Come on, give me three? Three? Okay, just two? Okay. That's fine. Home is... Which direction again? North, I think. Uh, it is south. Um, it is this direction. Home is definitely this direction. This was not the village I was thinking of, but it was a good find nonetheless. That's a granite spike. It seems familiar. Oh. <laughs> right, so I said, let's go back into the desert. And then I went here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and speed up time till we get back home. I will see you there. Alright, home we are. If the zombie villager despawned, you know what, I've decided that's okay. I won't get too mad. Mm, good, you're still here. This is not my house. Here's my house. 
You may not rest now, there. Ah, no! Well. I guess step one is actually going to be lighting this shit up, because... Ah, crud. I don't want to deal with you guys. Is there another village house I can run to with a bed? You assholes blew up my- You, your creeper friend, blew up my nice cyan bed. Now I have to get a new bed. And a new house, even. I'll tear this one down, I'll probably fill in this area with moss blocks or something. Paper, sugar cane, I'll take the iron, the apple, flower pot, jungle saplings, cactus, moss carpet, hay bales, coal. I don't need any of that or that. I'll take the clay and the lily pads, the gold nuggets, the jungle wood, the string. I don't want that. I want that. I can come back for the rest of this. I think I forgot that part. Let's just shove things away. For now. Obviously, we will have a proper sorting sorting system. Um, but for now, I just want things out of my inventory so I can move all my stuff. Ugh, I cannot believe a creeper blew up my house. And got rid of my cyan bed. That was my bed. Alright, so I am going to do a little bit of cleanup on this house. Uh, it needs some fixing up. And I will rejoin you guys after I do that. Alrighty, and there it is. The house is at least somewhat put together. Um, the floor, right, the floor. Um, I kind of want to do f f wood for the floor, like jungle wood. Uh, let's see. Or we could keep the moss. Or, alternatively, we keep the moss. And... Hmm. I like the jungle wood. Alright. 
so let's just dig up the floor. And replace it. I do wonder, though, if there is a lush cave under here. Okay, so with the way the door is facing... And um, I've had this um, map in my hands for a while. Um, I say what we do is first of all we shove all this shit away. Pufferfish. I make a new. Stone axe. And we go find this treasure. So we'll need to go north, northeast. So that way. Which means southwest is where we would need to go to head home. Dun 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 dun. Maybe, maybe we'll find enough iron to... Okay, hold on. I'm... I am grabbing our boat. Sadly, it appears axolotls don't spawn here, but we can change that. Tropical fish spawn here. Axolotls eat tropical fish. I don't know why the axolotls wouldn't love it here. Where's the boat? The boat? The boat? The boat? The boat? I guess I'll have to craft one. Alright. Let's go northwest. Northwestern we go. Oh, so it's roughly upwards. Dang. This is going to be quite the walk. Um, I'm going to speed it up. And then I will see you all again when we get there. Or not. Holy heck. Oh. Okay. This is a nice village. Oh my goodness. I'm so looting this place. Emeralds, potatoes. We'll incorporate the potatoes into our farm back home. Whoopsies. <gasps> candles. Ooh, I want to take the candles, but I don't want to break blocks just yet. I say that, and then immediately they have books and a lectern. Item frames! Perfect. Bookshelves. Efficiency potatoes. Oak saplings. 
I mean, am I still going to check and check around for the buried treasure? Oh, absolutely. Am I going to loot this place to death first? Also, yes. I'm taking all of their things. That is just a cactus farm, so it probably won't have anything. Iron golems. Not fucking with those, but... Ooh. Blocks of iron, so if I find a name tag, I can easily rename my villager. Grindstone to disenchant things. Holy fuck. Okay. This is kind of nice. Yeah, this ain't that bad. Could I? Yes. Should I? No. Okay, this place looks like it has a bed. It looks like it might be a dwelling. It better have a bed. Good grief. Yeah, let me steal your bed real quick. Sorry, kid. This is incredible. I... This is one of the data packs doing this for sure. Because... This is... Ooh, so cool. Just a cactus farm. Or cactus boyos. Ooh. More potatoes. A poppy. I like that. That's a shiny flower. Okay. Let's get back to looting this village. We had been in here, seen the sheep. I had not been up here yet. In whatever building this is. Bread, apples, a poppy, a feather. Delightful. Um, can we get up here? Oh, I don't think I've been in there yet. I'm not sure I know how to get out, but... All your chests belong to me, belong to me, belong to me. All your things belong to me right now. Arrows and a bow. Um, yes please. Ah, uh, but what do I- I only need one book and quill. At the moment. If, if if that if that let's be honest i don't need smooth stone so i can go ahead and 
Well, first of all, where's the door? Okay, so let's go back and check these other buildings up here. I did not check this one, so this one's contents are gold nuggets, bread. I don't, but I might need two iron picks. I don't, yes I do. I have oak saplings at home. I don't need rabbit hide. Uh, I'm keeping the candle. That is my candle. I don't need the cobblestone. I don't need the lily pads. I have a bajillion at home. Okay, now I just gotta check. I think this... Oh no, this was the first building we came across. And then this one. Okay. So find the village, find the building, go south and then to the west a bit. Okay, now let's find that buried treasure and hope I don't have to make too many hard decisions. Because, um, one thing you need to know is that I am a hoarder. What biome is over here? Do I even want to know? Oh, it's a biome that makes... that's not very bright and colorful. Although that is a genuine jungle biome. Like, cocoa beans and all. I'm going to need a crafting table. I am going to go ahead and craft an iron shovel. So that I can dig around for our treasure. And I really hope it's something good. Here we go, okay, let's start, whoopsies, it's literally just digging right here.
Okay, that is a creeper over there. Okay, so it's this way. got to be under one of these. God damn it. Okay, well, at least I can sleep. And then I can run back and get my stuff. And I bought myself time to figure out where the hell that treasure is. I need the treasure, because treasure. What is this, I wonder? A buried port- It's a buried portal frame. Alright. Get back to my stuff. I have like five minutes before it all despawns. All of it, including the treasure I got from the village. Okay, these haven't even despawned yet, so I should be hopefully in the clear for my own items. Icky biome that I don't like, icky, icky, icky. Sword, pick, axe, shuffle. Bread. Okay, so in theory... It should be down here. Okay. 
theory confirmed. It is right here. Okay, up we go. Alright, now, I can properly sort through all of this. I'll take the TNT and the leather tunic. I'm gonna immediately put it on. Mm, good. Leather. Leather is good. I like leather. Um... Is there anything I can keep for the sand? Because this was an awful lot of sand mining that I did. Oh, there was more stuff over here. Gold ore. Okay, okay. So now, get rid of the axe. Uh, do I get rid of the book? No, because I'm going to need that to craft a lectern. Um, okay, next step is to try and kill that witch and hope she drops some nether wart. Or not. But hey, I can get cocoa beans while I'm here. If I could find bamboo, that would be great, too. But I'll take just cocoa beans. If there are any... Cocoa beans, cocoa beans, cocoa beans. Gimme, 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 gimme. I don't need this map anymore. And there we have it. I just went and got treasure. Perfect. Part of me wants to excavate that giant nether portal now. Because who knows if I'll... Let's be honest, who knows if, I'll, if I'm going to come back here. I certainly don't know. So part of me is like, excavate the portal while you are here. And you know what? I can get behind that. Because look, it's got gold, and I know these things have chests. Spider? Spider where? Spider in an underground cave.
Alright, so we're going to excavate the portal, and then after that, I am probably going to end it, because I'm going to have a lot of editing to do. So... Yeah, let's get this portal done. Uh, anyone up for a speed dig? Like, you know, speed build, but with digging? Um... I'm keeping the heart of the sea. Y'all must be nuts if you think I ain't. Alright, let's do this. Oh, I found the... Perfect! I actually need one of those for my villager! Holy heck of Roonies! Okay. Yeet. I did not mean to yeet. Uh oh. Make it back to the village, please. Village, please. Village, please. I did not realize it was time to sleep. Run, 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 run. I don't wish to e explode or get killed by zombie. Zombie. Why are none of you asleep? None of my business. Just let me in your freaking house, freaking house, freaking house. Just let me in your freaking house so I can pass out. There we go! And that was our fun adventure today, everybody! And let's... Head back home. It is this way. See, there's home. It's literally just across the way. Okay, did Zomboy despawn? Boy, boss man, you still here? You still here? Good, 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 good. Anyway, that is going to be it for today, guys. Um, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe if you want to see more. Um, and I will see you all next time. Goodbye.